Is this a dynamite plot? How could this be done better? I've come across dynamite plots, and how they're suboptimal. Some sources even go as far to say they're never acceptable, which until just now, I thought I agreed with where I've gotten confused is the visualization of categorical data so counts of the frequency of a few groups. An example I found is this figure 5 from this paper it's a dynamite plot for all intents and purposes bars with error bars, but I can't see how this is wrong or even suboptimal for the type of data can someone explain this to me? Thank you. I had a professor who used to criticize these kind of plots, though the phrase dynamite plot is new to me. The main criticism he had was that presenting these bars with error bars suggests to the viewer that the main bar should be compared by way of the error bars, and when that is not a valid way to compare them as occurs typically, you are suggesting to the viewer to make an invalid comparison. He was particularly critical of dynamite plots in which the standard errors of the estimates were used for error bars. Figure 5 linked above at least uses confidence intervals for the error bars, so the error bars at least give the viewer an idea of the precision of the individual estimates, so that isn't as bad. Still, you wouldn't want to compare two estimates by just calculating confidence intervals of the two different estimates and seeing if they overlap, which is what viewers tend to do when they see dynamite plots.